Hello students, welcome back to my channel. In this video, I am going to discuss in brief about the molecular elevator. Molecular elevator is nothing but a molecular machine that behaves like a elevator in nano scale. So especially the size of the molecular elevator will be around 3.5 nanometers. So these molecular elevators can be created by the integration of subunits. Let us consider a simple molecular elevator which is obtained by the integration of three subunits. So it will be obtained by the integration of super bundle with 3,5 tetrabutyl benzyl bromide along with the ammonium hexafluorophosphate in the presence of methanol as the catalyst. So let us see the structure of the molecular elevator. So it is the basic benzene molecule and here the three subunits are joined. In such a way, it results in the formation of a molecular elevator. So, initially one benzyl molecule is attached to the center benzene molecule and it is connected to another benzene molecule through methylene and ammonium linkages and it is attached to pyridine molecule and which is also attached to another pyridine molecule and again it is attached to the benzene nucleus with the help of methylene group and the last benzene nucleus consists of tetra methyl groups at alternative positions it is the structure of one subunit the same structure will be repeated at the second and the third position and finally it is it results in the formation of a big molecule and that is called as the molecular elevator so it is the simple molecular elevator which is obtained by the joining of three subunits so the importance of this molecular elevator is each subunit undergoes deprotonation or reprotonation that means they also exhibits motion in three distinct steps that means these molecular elevators can act also act as light powered molecular motors that means they exhibits rotational motion also if you like the video don't forget to like share and subscribe thanks for watching have a nice day